all right guys welcome back to video game leaks and today we're going to talk about insomniac's spider-man 2 for ps5 and as you guys know this game is shaping up to be one of the biggest launches of this year and more specifically the biggest sony launch since god of war ragnarok now the upcoming ps5 exclusive is the long-awaited sequel to insomniac games 2018 spider-man which ended up selling way more than anticipated selling 33 million units by may of 2022 which is of course before the pc port came out and bumped those sales figures up even more now with the original game closing in on 40 million units units the sequel is going to be selling like crazy especially whenever it drops in the fall of 2023 but as of the recording of this video we don't really have anything concrete to go off of outside of the initial reveal trailer now we did get a few leaks however but as of right now we don't have any official gameplay footage or plot synopsis and we likely won't until sony officially kicks off the marketing campaign later this year now there's of course the big rumor of a playstation showcase happening industry insider jeff grubb actually recently talked about this on his podcast but essentially he's saying that new games for PlayStation 5 are going to release in phases and phase one of the PS5 is coming to a close which happened right after the release of God of War Ragnarok but we are about to be in phase two which is set to be revealed sometime very soon there's going to be a big PlayStation showcase before E3 that is going to be extremely hyped however on February 24th a long leak popped up on 4chan from someone claiming to be a play tester they gave a ton of details about the game's main story and in this video we're going to go over absolutely everything they said given the fact that this leak originated on on 4chan we do have to remind you to take everything with a grain of salt because as you guys know 4chan is notorious for fake leaks but there have been countless true leaks to come out there so i don't really know what to make of this just yet but i'll give you guys a brief spoiler alert here now with all of that out of the way let's go ahead and get into the leaks the february 23rd plot leak reads like this got back from play testing spider-man ps5 it looks amazing and i can't wait for people to play it obviously some hitches since it's still early and freshly past its beta phase from what i can tell anyway the story's got a relic from the original venom story i've never seen elsewhere early in the game pete and miles are scuffling through the city for a dude in a green ski mask who looks a lot like the sin eater who is a lesser known character from the comics who debuted in 1985. if you don't know in the comics sin eater was a serial killer in nyp ED, and Eddie Brock lost a job at the Daily Bugle because he interviewed some random guy who claimed to be the Sin Eater, who misleaded the police and the public. Spider-Man jumped to the real Sin Eater and revealed him to be a police officer. This was one of the many things that caused Eddie to hate Spider-Man, of course. The leaker then goes on to say that I don't know if this is actually real. I doubt they would adapt it that way because Peter is post Daily Bugle in the games. They said, I can confirm that there is someone in the game that looks like Sin Eater. The leaker then goes on to say that they asked us to test a few things and a few few level scripts in their alpha phase much further back than the others as far as I know and from what I can tell is the only things that they had in common with the rest of the game was a darker tone otherwise the geometry was completely green and blocky I was bug testing an enemy using grenades and SMGs on Spidey and a bunch of other enemy units the goal was to stop him slash her from killing them every time I tried to do a finisher on them the game crashed so they asked me to stop trying to do that another level with the same premise but it opens with a woman in a leather jumpsuit and a female thug's corpse the leaker said that it falls and moves a bit before she bleeds out apparently alpha phase basically squared polygon geometry and stuff they asked me to keep webbing up the enemy every time they restarted it so i guess they wanted to see the code for when it happens in multiple scenarios i want to think that it's a dlc or something so what do you guys think about this leak remember it came from 4chan which means it could be totally made up but also could end up being entirely true and we just won't know until the game comes out i have to admit the idea of bringing sin eater into the fray is pretty exciting and it would make sense for insomniac to do that in the 2018 game insomniac brought in a ton of fan favorite villains like doc ock and the vulture but they also have a heavy spotlight on lesser known characters like mr negative we know that venom and craven the hunter are going to be in spider-man 2 but what if sin eater is also joining the fray as a more in-depth deep cut villain all we can do at this point and wait and see if it ends up being true but be sure to give me your thoughts on spider-man 2 so far in the story predictions in the comments below make sure to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any future updates and i will talk to you guys in the next video